All right, Durka, 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 that's working. Greetings, people. My name is Andrew. Welcome back to the Talos Principle 2. This game is awesome. Let's go solve some puzzles. Let's see how smart we are today. We should be in the south, south two. In this area, we have an especially weird problem. Do we? Something in one of the labs is going completely bananas and I can't shut it down because I'm not, well, you. Okay. Come find me when you're ready. I will do that. What is it with the language libraries and bananas? I was just thinking that. What's with bananas? Yeah. Okay, cool. So let me show you on the map real quick how far we've come. We're down here at the bottom. We are in south too. We've done east, north, and now we're on south. So we're pretty much 50% complete. So let's not waste any time. Let's just jump straight in. Number one, straight ahead. Let's go see what puzzles we've got today. Oh, that's got a lift inside. Interesting. No switch. All right. So, Mountaineer. Uh, oh, here we go. You can jump onto these walls. Do 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 do. So we need to get up there. Oh, and there's a new device. Okay, so now we're upside down. We need to cross over to this side. Do 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 do. And just drop down. Uh, twice. Douche. Okay. The grav shifter. Okay, cool. Maybe we need to get in there. There's a floor thing over there, and this releases that. Okay. What does the grav shifter do? Oh, that's what was creating that. Interesting. So... If we put this... Wait, how do we make... Oh, I see. It only connects to those surfaces. Interesting. Okay. So there is only this one area. And then this area here. And there's a thing up there. So how are we going to get... Oh, does that pull it over? Oh, that's pretty cool. Then if I put this here, we can get through. Take that, jump off. Wait, is it better in third person? Yeah. You can kind of see what's happening then. Okay. So now that we've got the device... I wonder if we can reverse the polarities, because that means we could connect that to that, and then put it up here, and just drop it off. Oops. <laughs> Too easy. <laughs> Alright. Too easy. Hmm. Well, number one usually is easy. So now we've learned the about the language of creation is a kind shifter. of melody. Maybe that's why we respond to music the way we do. Do we? Because we recognize something that can't be expressed in any other way. All right. And when we play music, we participate in something ancient. Do in we? An, in an act of creation. Fascinating discovery there, Yakut. Spider web. Okay, so we've got another grav shifter. There's a surface there. It said spider web. This is where we need to get to. There's the blue thing. So we need. 
Ah, there's a fan. That'll just blow me up into the air. That's not going to be of any use to us. So we need to get in here. Okay. Oh, I see. If I do that first... Is there anything else? How do I get myself over there? Oh, wait, I know. If I take that... And put this... There... That will take me up into it? But then if I drop into this room... I'm stuck in this room. Okay, this thing only goes one direction, so let's jump off. Ah, oh, there's a ladder. Okay. So now we need to... Oh, I see. Put this here, in the middle. Boop. Climb over. Take this. Put this here. Then how do I get it? Ah! Aha! Oh, that's too high. Damn it. Okay, so let's go a little bit lower. That gives me that. Oh, wait a second. Oh, I see. Connect. Just plop that over there. That should do it. Okay, easy. Ta da! Uh, how do we go? Okay, so that's one and two done. We've got information. What have we got? Research. Grab manipulation. Okay, we've already discovered that. Three is this way. Splash. The frogs just spawn out of the ground. Check it out. They just spawn out of thin air. Which makes me think this whole place is a simulation. Nothing on the back. Okay, what are we doing in here? Upward migration. Okay, there's a platform there and a platform there. So we're going to have to move the thing across and across and across. There's the grab thing. So I think the contraption we need is in this room. Oh. So can I take it up? Wait, where do we need to get it to? Um, here. We need that and that connected. So maybe we have to connect it first before we move it around. And we've got two of them. Wait, where, where's the final puzzle? Where's the end goal? Oh, it's in here. Oh, okay, so we need to use both of these. Okay, so in order to get this one up and running... Okay, I see what we've got to do. I see it. So if we take this one, for example, and we... connect that one, and... Oh, 
this doesn't go okay. I see. Hold on. Do 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 do. Now if we put this one here, let's move this one out of the way for now. Keep connection. Put that there. We take this one up. Doop. Okay. We also need to get one all the way this side. Okay, I see what we got to do. So now we take, um, we move it across the other way. Okay, hold on. The other way. Bloop. Just like so. Then we need to connect this one to that one. And this one. And then just move it across. It should be that simple. So, we need to go up. Wait, up. Once it's up, and then we just need to move it across. And that should do it. <laughs> Too easy, man. <laughs> <laughs> Too easy. I'm glad to see all those overloads haven't damaged your logic circuits. Nah, man, that was easy. It's gonna get harder. It's got to get harder. Interface new content. Don't be social media. Sorry to be a grump. That's what boring. Don't care. This is exactly. But whatever. You should learn to less blah blah blah. I don't. I don't care. I'm sick of reading. I just want to solve puzzles. Oh, first time I've seen a fox. Where are you going, buddy? Where's the fox going? I've seen frogs, deers, um, birds. That's it, yeah, frogs, deers, and birds. Okay, whatever. Do 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 number four. See, there's the bird. Oh, and fireflies. Not fireflies, dragonflies. Oh, that's cool, man. It's just a nice... It's an unnecessary touch to the game, which I appreciate. It's like... Dragonflies. That's cool, man. It makes the game feel more alive. So, number four. This one looks a bit more complicated. Lateral thinking. Okay, so there's a cube up there. So, here we have this. Okay, so let's get inside. What does this do? Oh, I think this will keep the gate open. Okay, so we need to get up that way. I think that's what I need the square for. So if we go up this way, and we take the square, we can just let go. And then take this out. Yes. And now we've got to get blue. There's red. There's blue. Ah. Wait, so why can't I connect that to here? But then we need to be out. But if I'm down low, it's not going to be able to reach it. Yeah, the angle's too much. Okay, so how do we... Hold on. It looks like we can stand on this other thing. On the side. Let's have a look. It's like if I'm here... Boop, I 
should be able to connect to that and that and leave it just here. Ha 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 ha! Man, easy, easy. I've known Byron since day one. I was the first to be born with upgrades from the original Soma design, and he was the first to volunteer to upgrade his existing body. There's a fox. Yeah, he was a big supporter of upgrades. Deliberate evolution. Oh, there's a purple it. dude. Athena and Cornelius were very kind to me, and so was Byron, but he also made fun of me. And oddly enough, that made me feel more like an equal than anything the others said. What are you looking at? Today, for the first time, I synthesized life. Well done. It was just a unicellular cyanobacterium. Sure. But the sheer complexity of even such a flies, simple dude. organism is breathtaking. Creating it from pure energy, I was filled with a sense of awe and majesty. A, a sense that what I was doing was sacred. Okay. It made me think about the enormous Recycling. power of life. Two and a half billion years ago, these simple beings terraformed the entire planet, creating the oxygen that underlies the Earth's incredible biodiversity, wiping out thousands of other species, but making the future possible. Uh -huh. That'll just blow me back. This will open this door. Come here. Let's change my angle. Wait, where did I see the blue beam? Oh, I think it was outside. Okay. Ah. Where did I see the blue beam? Hold on a second. I didn't fully investigate. So let's just uh, take this. There it is. Okay. Oh, okay. So isn't that just a matter of doing that, that? Oh, no, we're going to have to use the block. Okay. I'm going to have to put this here. Take the block. Make a trade. To get this over this side that I can get this up in the air. Um, yes, I think so. Where is it? Ah. I was about to say this is too easy, and then we come across this problem. Ah. So that's just to open up that door, but how do we open this one? Oh wait, can I... I can't take the square. Ah. Awesome. My first little dilemma. How do we get over there? I need to take something with me. How do I... Wait, hold on. Can't I... If I jump up here... And turn sideways? I can't walk off that way. Wait, if I... Okay. Ooh, okay. My first place where I've actually got to use my brain. Thinking, thinking, thinking. How do we get onto that one? That's just going to open up this one door. That has to be up there to open up this one. How do I get another block over here?
Wait, what was this one called? There's always a clue. What was the clue? Lateral thinking, was it? Oh, recycling. Recycling. If I put that there, where does it send it to? Recycling, recycling. Wait, I don't get it. I don't get it. What does recycling mean? I have to have something on here in order for me to get over here. I have to have something on here to open up. Oh, okay, I don't know. Oh, hold on. Can I take the fan blade? No, I can't. And that angle's too steep. You can't see through there. Recycling. How does that help me? Um... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do. That has to stay up there to open up that door. There's no way around that. There's no ladders anywhere, is there? Oh, maybe. There's no gravity thing here. This gravity thing only works on that wall. Is that how it's done? Okay. I think I just figured it out. I think I just figured it out. Okay. I think I just figured it out. It all makes sense now. So, leave the block there. Take this bad boy. Over here. Uh, connect the dots. So, connect him. To him. He then... Take that off. Put this guy on there. Ah, oh, I've disconnected it. Connect. Connect. Leave that on there. Now I can take this guy. Knocks me over. At which point I can do this. And then this. Ta da! <laughs> Alright, awesome. Figured it out. Here we go. So clever. Yay! Oh, another interface. What do you guys want, man? Social research. Environmental observation. This environment has been modified to boring. Okay. I just want to solve puzzles, man. The game has got a good story, but yeah, I've kind of heard enough. My main enjoyment is doing the puzzles. Uh, don't care, don't care. Yeah, whatever. There is some like deep philosophical meaning that the story is trying to tell you, but whatever. Uh, other side. Break on through to the other side. Okay. Um. Okay, so I get the impression this one is going to do whatever that is. 
take this guy with me. Ooh. That's not gonna work. Which means we're gonna have to... Oh, and we need two. Where's the platform? Is it this surface? Wait, let me test the device. See what it works on. It doesn't work on that surface. It doesn't work on that surface. So what do we use this on? Ah, it works on this surface. that work? But then I'm going to be stuck. Okay, so I can get sucked through one of those holes. Interesting. Because he, he goes into the fetal position. Okay. Oh, of course. If it sucks me through, then I might suck this thing through as well. So if I put this here, it sucks us both through? Oh, interesting. Okay. Didn't know it could do that. Alright. Too easy, man. Another interface. What do you guys want? Social media. As long as I don't have to answer it, I don't care what they're saying. Number seven. Let's go. Delivery. Okay, so we've got a fan. Oh, okay, so when you turn that on, the door activates. That's what this is. Okay. That's where we need to be to, or get to. This one. Ah. Delivery. Ah, there's a thing there. And a square over there. And this is the red. So we need to get the device stuck on that wall. Okay, so if we've got squares. Let's just do a trade. Um we're going to have to get ourselves another square. Wait, this isn't going to... That's not going to work. It needs to go the other way. So if I did that, it sucks it across there. Okay. And that is where we need... Oh... I'm starting to see the picture. Oh, okay. Wait, can I... If I do that and that... Aha! There's a thing in my bob. Oh, I wonder if I could have set that up before I swapped. Um. No, you can't set up the thing through the barrier. Okay, well that's a problem. Um. 
Okay, that's a problem. So having that and that, that doesn't help me because I can't get to it. Yes, I can. I can jump. Oh, why did he fall off? He doesn't stay on that. There's a ladder here. Oh, okay, cool. So now we've got an actual problem. We need to try and figure out how to solve this. There's no ladder on the inside of this one. We need to get that on top of there to shine the beam here but I need to get that cube if I take this the door closes which means I can't get out um what was it called what was the clue Delivery. Delivery. So all I've done is move that cube across, which is all I could do. Uh, hold on a second. No, that's not going to work. It's not going to work. Delivery. It says delivery. So if I turn this on, then I can't get through there. Um. Wait a second. If I take that, put this on here. If I take that. No, that's just that's just going to blow off. I know it's just going to blow off. You have to use a square on that, but if I take the square, then I can't... Then I can't take anything else. Because what I could do now, which is not going to help me at all, is I can move that square across, but that square will then fall down, maybe. Because it won't be... There won't be gravity onto it. Oh, I can't do it through here. Oh, you suck. I can't do it through there. Um. Ooh, okay. I'm actually really don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. Oh. Okay, wait, let's reset it. Because maybe I did something wrong. Let's just reset. We got we got loads of time. I like to give myself two hours per zone. Not per puzzle, per zone. So that's there. There's no. It's like, why would I need a ladder inside here? You see, the only thing I can think to do. I'll take that off. Stop it for that. 
then I then I can't get out of here. That's why you have to have the square. That's why you have to have the square there, because you have to have something in there at all times. These don't work. If you put these on here and pull the lever, it just just pushes it off to the side. And I can't I can detach the fan, dumbass. Okay. I know what to do now. I know what to do. You can detach the fan. I forgot about those. So now let's go and detach the fan. We'll take this with us. We'll leave that there. Take the block off. We'll leave the fan here for now. I'm pretty sure we need to move that thing across. Or before we do that, let's just leave that there. Use this to swap for this. I want to see what's inside this room. That's there and that's there. This just gives me this room and there's a step. Okay, so now if I take this. This just brings the cube over to me. Okay. And I can't get that cube. It says I can jump onto it, but that doesn't help me at all. Oh, I can't jump onto it now. Weird. Okay. No, wait, but, 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 but. Now I should be able to do this. Yes. <laughs> because I've got the two things. Yes. Come here. Okay. Progress. We're making progress. Now we no longer need to be in that room, which means we have all these devices. So, we've got the spare square, so one of them is going to go down here. And we're going to need the fan off, which means this contraption. Ooh, hold on. So that's going to have to stay on top of that on the fan. Because I'm pretty sure I have to get this on there in that corner. But I can't make this beam from inside this room. I have to be outside the room. Because in order to... get those two things over there... Oh wait! I know. I know. It's not going to take both. It's only going to take one of them. Which is going to be this thing. Ha 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 ha! Which means I can go and get the block afterwards. So now, if I do this... It should only take... Uh, dickhead, you've got to push the fan on. It helps if you turn it on. Okay. I think I've got it. Now, I only want to move. Oh, that's going to take the block away. Take the block, and then the fan... Oh, that's still on top of it. Okay. Oh, wait, there, of course. Now I can go back and get the fan blade. Dumbass. Of course I can. And that gives me the third item I need inside here. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't fucking connect it. Idiot. I didn't connect it, man. I didn't connect it. <laughs> For fuck's sake, Andrew. I didn't connect it. Ah, oh, that's a fail. 
Okay, reset. I forgot to connect it. I got so excited figuring out the, the actual mystery. I forgot to connect it. Okay, so take the fan. Put the fan here. Take that out. Put that there. Take this. Swap it there. Take that. Swap. Okay, now we need to bring the cube across. We need to open it up. And then we need to bring the cube down. Oops. Bring the cube down. Gotcha. Come with me. I can sit. Whoops. Oh wait, the, I need to get the fan blade again. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't forget to connect it. So let's just get the connection. That one and that one. Uh, we don't need that one. So let's just leave these connected. Now, we can go in here. Do a trade for the fan blade. Put that there. Put that there. Here we have to be careful. We want to keep the connection. Pop it on top. Turn the fan on. Go over here. Bring them across. Take it off. Run all the way here. Turn the fan off. Take the fan cover. Do the old switcheroo. Take this. And this should solve the puzzle. Ta-da! Okay, that, that one took me the longest. That we got there. Solution. Yes. Figured it out, man. Okay, that one was the most complicated so far. What are you doing, Yakut? So, number eight is this way. Alright, that one was a bit tricky, but we got there in the end. Once I realized you can take the fan blade, which I know you can on some of them, you just gotta check each time. Step and release. See, like these ones, you can also take the blade. Oh, step and release. Ah, okay, cool. So we got to we got to swap some things. So there's the grav shifter. There's the disruptor, or the jammer. And then there's this wall here. To give me that one. Okay, so I need two things. Okay, so I need two things. If I do that... Oh wait, first we need to get the old... ...device. Okay. So if we swap that... Move this across. Where's the thing? Is it in the center? It's just there. So, 180... It's in the center. So if I do that... Yep, that'll work. Uh, oh, hold on. Oh, it doesn't stay in place. Of course it doesn't. Okay, I know what to do. Here we go. Put that there. Stand here. Think that just gets sucked across. Oh, man. Get off. Dude, get off. Take that away. Now we've got this. And what do we need with this for? We need to get that. Which means I need two things. Oh. Or we can get it from higher up. Well, there's the jammer. Okay, so let's leave this here. Take this one up. 
Oh, but I need to trade something. Ah. I need to trade. I need to trade, I need to trade, I need to trade. Ooh, uh, shit. Okay, so it has to be this thing. Yes. Second one, no. Right. Oh, oh! I need the jammer for the for the back one. Ah, okay. Wait, what was this called? Step and step and slide. What was it? Step and release. I can't get that from there. And I need two things, I need three things down here. No wait, I am the third thing. Hold on a second. No, but I need this. Because these two only open up this door. It doesn't open the second one. Okay, so if I do... Okay, hold on. Come here. If I put you there, you... There... Then I have access to the back one. Now I need to take this bad boy, swap it with this fella, and then once I get him, so if I do that, it'll charge him up. Success. So now that he's charged, we can use him to do this. All I've got to do now is get the fan blade back. Okay. Ooh, which means... Okay. Swap. I need the fan blade up there. But if I disconnect that... How... okay, um... Okay, a little bit confused now. Because I need something to swap. With this one, but I'm pretty sure if I... Let's find out. If I try and swap this... Where's the thing? I have to turn the fan on. But I need to swap it. What was the swap swap and release? Is that what I said? Step and release. Oops. 
Wait, wait, what's going on? Hold on. Okay, I'm always just going to fall back down to the ground. It's not going to... Wait, where's my character? Let me see what's happening here. So we can't jump onto that one. No. Okay, so we need to get that. Step and release. going the other way. Okay, so I don't actually know what to do. And I'm thinking... Okay, that, that thing there cannot be on the pad. It just can't be. So I have to swap that with something. The only thing free that I've got is the fan head. But if I... Of this or this of course man idiot I'm being so stupid it's so simple it's fucking right there I didn't need that device to get to that one only to this one it's so obvious Okay, there we go. Easy. And in this wall, I can walk up. This one is the one I only needed the gravity shifter for. Okay, figured it out. Is that all eight? Awesome, so we did all eight in under an hour. The last couple took me longer than it should have. Let's go see if we can find the triangle ones. Uh, the lost puzzles. This might be... No, this is number one. What's off in this direction? I'm looking at the map. or oh, the compass. There's a question mark. How deep is this water? Not bad. Is a palm reader. Oh, we can see what Trevor has to say. What has Trevor got to say? He's usually just insulting everybody. But... After we talked about science fiction, Alex gave me a book. Her favorite book, a novel called Athena. It's not exactly what I'm used to reading, but it's pretty good. And it really made me wonder how we're going to be perceived. If this project works out, are we going to be mythologized? Is Alexandra going to be this distant mythical figure instead of the real funny human person that she is? It's hard to imagine that we'll all have been dead for hundreds of years. <coughs> Man, I'm scared. Okay, Trevor. I'm really scared. Don't stress, buddy. I don't want to die. Well, we all die eventually. Here we go. This is one of the triangle ones. See there? These are the lost puzzles. These are usually a bit harder. Question block. There's a block. Let's question the block. That opens that. Okay. Can we detach this? See, some fans you can't detach. So that puts that on. This means we have to do something with the block. Well, that'll bring it over, won't it? No, it needs to go this way. Zoop. Okay. Give me the block. So the question is the block. Okay. 
Oh, wait, I see. Oh, dude, no, it's not that simple. It can't be that simple. There's always a catch. Ooh. Ah, see, this is the catch. We can't get it up, which means we've got to do it this way. Okay, stand on here. Capture block. Ooh, it doesn't go high enough. It doesn't go high enough. Wait, wait, I can bump it up. There we go. Of course. Ooh, but I can't get through here. Ah, but I can make a force field through the purple. I just can't make the force field through the blue. Okay, that enables me to bring this across. Which helps me how? Alright, how do we open this gate? How do we open this gate? It's got a thing there. Oh, do I just have to get over it? Yes. <laughs> Alright, cool. That's what the block was for. Easy day, man. Easy day. Alright, let's go find the next question mark. Um, is there a way around the back of this? Let's have a look. Looks like it. Oh, there's a fan. How do we get up there? Okay. I don't know. So what's this one? This is number three. There's a question mark straight ahead. Which looks like just another sculpture. How do we get up there? don't see a way up. Now, how do you get up there to that question mark? I didn't see a way up. Uh, it's right through here. I ran straight past it. Okay, my bad. Find my sprite and follow it until it leads back here. You see, those I've not really come across yet. The little sprites. I think I've seen one. Ah, and this is the golden gate. Which we're going to have to come and solve later. So let's go this way. There's a question mark... Just over here somewhere. Is this the other triangle one? It looks like it might be. Nope, this is number six. Yeet. There it is. Okay. Oh, and there's a sprite, I think. This little thing here. This, I believe, is a sprite. 
that should go back to one of the stars. Oh wait, it, it stopped there. Oh, do I have to literally follow it? Okay. Okay, this is different. Oh, dude, where'd it go? Oh, here we go. I am following the sprite. This reminds me of following the little musical note in Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Okay, it's going towards that star. I'm curious to see what this is going to do. I can go up. This better be good, whatever it's doing. Oh, really? It brings me to somewhere where I can't get over. Okay, let's go do the purple dude first. Come on, out with it, what's the problem? I know you're very busy, but you need to pay more attention to what's happening. Everything's slowing down. People are losing track of the bigger picture. They're still traumatized by New Alexandria. It's more than that. When I organized the last expedition, oh, I had fuck real sake, trouble up top finding there. volunteers. There's no enthusiasm for the outside world anymore. They want to look yeah. away from history, pretend there's no past and no future. I'm really worried, Athena. Okay. I promise I'll look into it as soon as I'm done with this. Alright, let's find this bloody thing. Where do you reckon it went? Yeah. Okay. Now hopefully it's gonna go left. And to that statue. Whoa, whoa, don't jump off there. Yes, yes, it's finally going there. There's that little plaque with the sign said, find my sprite and lead it back to me. So let's see what this does. After all that running around, it better be good. Ooh. And then you get... Oh, you Not to... all things must be balanced. When good is weighed against evil, tip the scale. Okay, so what did that do? I've discovered what seems like another mystery to solve. Stars, clearly inspired by the simulation, which are gained by solving puzzles related to these monuments to Pandora, Prometheus and the Sphinx. Perhaps these stars are somehow related to what Yakut dubbed the Astronomical Temple. 
Okay, so there's like there's there's two of those in each each zone. This is the first time I've actually found one. In all these other zones, I didn't find any. I found the statues where they got to go to, but I didn't actually find the sprite and lead it all the way back. Interesting. So that's just. I think that was more like a recording. The entity didn't appear, and the system didn't react either. Stars, huh? Seems like another connection to the simulation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me go find that other... Shit, I've lost myself now. Where am I? I want to find the other lost puzzle. There's a palm reader. Lifthrusher. On my last return to New Jerusalem, I perused the latest artistic offerings and found myself deeply disappointed. There is nothing more despicable to me than an artist who pursues the appearance of morality. Moral art is trash, garbage, not even good enough to be used as wallpaper. If art is a religion, then morality is for those who want to be seen in church. True art is for those who believe. Art must be ecstatic, a work of revelation, created in pursuit of the truth, no matter where it leads. An artist must be an agent of chaos in times of order. And an agent of order in times of chaos. Alright, dude. He seems like a... a madman. Okay, so this is where the other triangle puzzle was. Before I found the sprite. And there's also a purple thing down this way. This is usually a group of guys standing around doing something. Ah, cats. What's going on, pussycat? Yeah, these people had a thing for cats for some reason. Weird. Alright. Never mind, let's solve this last puzzle and get out of here. Stowaway. Okay, so who's a stowaway? Ah, there's a platform there, which will shoot something across there. This opens up... Oh, that thing's hidden away. Okay. There's the contraption that we need. We can't get access to that. This... Turns the fan on. We need to get that cube out of there. So this is the only place we can put something. Okay. Does this... Whoops. Oh, you can't put that on there. Ah. Ah, okay. Because uh, I need to get this up there and I can't... I can't jump into that. I can detach the fan. Yeah, it just puts me up there, and this will suck me across. Okay, so we need... Yeah, we need to get that little tripod that's over in that direction. On here. Link to this red and that red. To get the blue. I have to get the square. 
but how do I get it up? Ugh, I'm so stupid, man. The answer is right in front of me. It's right here. Don't don't get in. Don't get don't get stuck in the beam. What I gotta do? It's so obvious. Here we go. Take this down. And give me that. Put that there. Take this. Make the gravity beam. Now. Then pick this up. Whee! Whee! Okay. Link that to that. Go and get the cube. Ah, too easy, man. Boing. Oh, this is going to be a dilemma, because that's going to be in the way. So if I link that to there, and that to there, I wonder if we can get it over the top, because this is going to be in the way. Yes. Okay, so this needs to... Ooh. Ooh. Let's try. See, that's not high enough. Okay, it's not as simple as I thought. We no longer need that, so we can go and get the fan blade. No, no we can't. Yes, we can. Ah, oh, okay, I know what to do. I think I know what to do. Wait. Do I know what to do? No man. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> no man, get... <laughs> you see, the flan, the fan blade will be lower. So if I take that, jump on here. Oh, I can't jump up. Oh, you suck. Oh, wait, 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 of course. We can do this. We can do this. Aha. See, because the fan blade is lower than the square. So it won't interfere with the beam. Success. Alright, we are a genius. Let's get out of here. Make our way back to the ring. Go and speak to the mystical creature. It'll probably be Pandora this time. Oh, I need to speak to Mel. There you are. Good. What's happening? Inside this lab, there's a machine. Okay. As usual, I have no idea what it is. Some sort of generator, if I had to guess. When Byron got stuck in the system, it went haywire. It's currently outputting enough energy to power all of New Jerusalem twice. As you can imagine, that's causing quite a bit of interference. Okay. So, am I connecting to another data stream? I hope not. I think you should just be able to switch it off. Oh, okay. I'll do that. Let's go switch it off. Nothing that way. Yeah, in each of these zones, there's a lab. Oh, this one's freaking out. Oh. Error, error, error. These are all just errors. Okay, what about emergency shutdown? Warning, output max parameters exceeded. Safety protocol cannot adjust output to correcting setting. Error, blah, 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 blah. Identify user. Error. Unknown user. Da, 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 blah, 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 blah. Okay. Initiate emergency shutdown. Initiate emergency shutdown. Access denied. Blah, 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 blah. Unknown atom script loaded. Yes, load. 
Uh, what was credits? Written design and program by Alex16. Okay, play. You wake up in... Oh, okay, cool. We have to do a little a puzzle. You wake up in an impossible place knowing nothing. <laughs> Go back to sleep. <laughs> Look around. You seem to be in a labyrinth of ancient crumbling walls. Beneath you is an altar of some kind, as if you were a sacrifice. The sky above you is a perfect cobalt blue, and you are startled by its beauty. Okay, examine the altar. Examine yourself. Reach for the sky. The sky above you is a perfect... Well, the altar would make sense. The altar is a place of birth and a place of death. You sense that blood was spilt. Here. That lives blah blah blah. This is how all things came into existence. But it is how all things must continue. You gained knowledge sacrifice. Okay. A cold wind blows through the ruins and you know without wait and you know without knowing how that is the wind from the kingdom of Artemis. Okay. It is the wind that brings with it whispers of mountains glimpsed across the stormy sea and deep forests weathered in fog and a long forgotten cities of the ancestors. Okay, explore the labyrinth. You set out into the ruins, apprehension but curious. There's a strange kind of beauty here, the beauty of decay. You must be careful not to imbibe, imbibe too much of it. All right. Suddenly an echoing voice is speaking to you. Um, this is corrupted, must put in, in corruption, what? The sting of death, one is sin. What? Suddenly an echoing voice speaks to you, the sting of death. This is corruptible, must put on, I'll try that one. Leaving the lost children of Hephaestus. Behind you, you step out onto a vast plain under a setting sun. Night is falling now, and you can see the light of a distant fire of the slopes of Olympus, but you are not ready to ascend. Once, only once you have found all three sigils, will the path of the divine flame be open. A path leads to the south, to the buried city. Another leads north to the garden of Hesperides, Hesperides, whatever. Journey to the buried city, journey to the garden. Wait, one path leads south to the buried city, another leads north to the garden of that place. Let's go to the garden. Your journey is interrupted by a frightful burned figure standing alone in the sands of the desert. Ooh, do we fight or do we flee? The journey is interrupted by a frightful, burned figure. Let's go flee. Warning. Output max parameter exceeds safety protocol setting. Error. Cannot adjust output. What? The nymphs lead you to a place with the crowns of a brass tree. What the fuck? Maybe I was supposed to fight. And grow together, forming a kind of chamber strange remnants and blah 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 in the middle of the chamber grows a small tree made of bright blue steel upon the tree grows a single golden apple it'll okay, take the apple the nymphs put the delicate mechanical fingers on your chest stopping you this apple they say is unison the eyes aglow confers the gift of deathlessness and true wisdom many heroes and not a few villains have come to claim it but all faltered in the final step, for you must know the deathlessness reveals the morality of the world, and true wisdom, its unending folly. Who would take this burden upon themselves? <laughs> Punch the nymph. <laughs> Beg them to let you have the apple. 5358. Five, Say what you are strong enough to bear it. Knowledge is self. Explain that the world needs you to succeed. Knowledge is world. Offer to trade part of yourself for the apple. Knowledge is sacrifice. Let's try that one. Which part of yourself would you like to give up? My name, my heart, my 
My BA? What's that? My car? My shadow? You can have my shadow. A dangerous choice. What is a man without a shadow? Who is not anchored in the world? Journey to the buried city. Oh, I've got to get three sigils, so I failed one. Okay. The buried city lies in the south. It was once a place of great wisdom. The philosophers of old strolled onto the walkways, debating the nature of virtue and the soul. Now the sands of the desert have claimed its streets, and even its famed temple upon a hill is slowly eroding. A call out. A copper fox comes scurrying from the ruins. Its eyes are rubies, and the flames and the flame seems to flicker deep within them. How may I help you, the fox says, its voice ancient and wild. Ask for a sigil, ask to learn more about the buried city, ask for the emergency shutdown. Now let's find out more about the buried city. They say the city fell because the citizens were sinners and so were stuck down, struck down by Zeus. This seems unlikely to me, for Zeus does not believe in sin. What? Okay, ask for a sigil. The fox smiles it's a bolstered teeth sharp and cleaning. You are supposed to earn the sigils. Say that you deserve it. Say that your quest matters. Say that nothing is really earned or deserved. Knowledge is world. Okay. You do not have this knowledge. Say nothing is really earned or deserved. No. Say that your quest matters. Say you deserve them. No, your quest matters. It does, the fox says, but only because you choose to believe so. There is great power in that belief. You've gained a sigil. Okay, journey to Olympus. Suddenly, the voice of the Sphinx, blah, 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 her golden wings, her shower coast, okay, initiate emergency shutdown. No, you must not do this. Pandora commands you. I have stopped you for this reason, or for a reason. If you complete your quest and ascend Olympus, everything will burn. Throw the sigils at Pandora, retry. Point out that Pandora is destabilizing the whole system. Then she sighs. You speak the truth, capture of clay. Even I cannot use the flames wisely. wisely. Access granted. Terminating. Did we do it? Done. The flame is not yours to wield, creature of clay. Touch it, and you will burn. Okay. It says enter the tower. Okay, cool. That was a lot of reading. Ugh, hopefully we've done it. Let's see what Melville has to say. Where is she? Is she still waiting outside? You know, dealing with this hyper-advanced technology is quite challenging enough without the place also being bloody haunted. Did you figure out what... Did you figure out anything else about the generator? When I said it was outputting enough energy for two new Jerusalems, I wasn't kidding. It really was. And no emissions of any kind. I'd have to run more tests, but it seems like a perfect power source. Uh, that's very promising, but it was going, in your words, bananas. True, but that was user error. Um, fair enough. Anything can be used badly. Pellegrino once almost killed himself with a bucket. But I'm pretty sure I could idiot-proof this thing if they let me. Oh, well. We'll see. Thank you, Melville. She's like... One of the most useful people on our little adventure. The rest just talk. She actually does stuff. So let's go find the ring. Which is up there. So we need to get up. Up here somewhere. Okay, let's go figure this out. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, so we need to go back this way. And find the way up, which is here. 
So now that we've solved all the puzzles and fixed the power problem, we should be able to make our way into this big device up top. Okay, let's go with that one. Different. Not that one. Not that one. Maybe that? done it. Okay, this is cool. I like I like going up these things, it's trippy. Whee! Oh, okay. Usually we land in the in the chamber, now we have to go up further. Oh, what's around here? Let's have a look. Is it just a nice view or is there something you can do here? It's just a cool view. Check it out. That's awesome. Okay, nothing here. So let's just go into the main compartment. Which is this one. Because we need to activate the gun. Oh, here we go. Pandora? Yes. The philosopher Stratum of Stagira had little respect for the gods, okay. and instead placed his faith in Prometheus. Driven by hubris, he asked questions that must not be asked, and revealed secrets that should have remained hidden. Uh -huh. It is said that for these offenses, he was put to death by the people of his city. Can you see the folly of his actions? Well, for asking questions? It's never folly to pursue the truth, even if it's even if there's a cost. There is no folly in pursuing truth. It was only the methods that were mistaken. I can. He should have respected the traditions of belief of it. No. I can. It was foolish for him to give his own life in pursuit. No. The folly was not his. It was the people who acted foolishly. Yeah, that one. Yet he was the one who broke their laws. Why do you judge them? And not him. Because their laws are stupid. Because he did not take a life. Because unjust laws should be broken. Because the truth is the only thing the future can be built upon. Ooh. Well, unjust laws shouldn't be broken. Unjust laws should be, like, stopped. They shouldn't exist. I'm going to go to the bottom one. You see this? And yet entire empires have been built on dreams, lies, and illusions. And they've all crumbled. And where are those, em where are those empires now exactly? You're right, but we cannot keep lying. Some dreams are truthful, and they would have been better built than uh, this one. They are ashes and dust. But do you truly believe that a world built on truth would fare differently? Yes. Um, it's worth trying at least. When you put it that way, no, probably not. Or these two. I'm going to say just yes. Then you are more innocent than I expected. But innocence will not protect you from the flame. I am not afraid of fire. That may be, but then I choose to be innocent. My belief in truth does not come from innocence, but from the hard lists of human history, that one. You have built something beautiful out of reason and memory. But it too will burn. So? As she did. 
All right. I think we've passed a little test. All right. Well, that was surprisingly calm, given how aggressive Pandora has been elsewhere. I didn't think she'd even want to talk to you. I've toyed with the idea that the entities might be epiphenomenal in some way. Instead of causing the changes in the system, maybe they just respond to them. Okay, which way are we going? Uh, yeah. Do 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 do. Jump. Do 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 do. Here we go, cool, so this area is finished. We can now move on to the third and final part of the south. Here we go, number three. So this was um, a Burdant Canyon, south two. And we're going over to Circulus Oasis, Oasis, okay. I remember when I was quite young, I was having trouble figuring out what I wanted to do. I wanted to see the outside world, but even back then, that wasn't really encouraged. I ran into Byron on Jameson Avenue, completely by accident, and I was too nervous to talk to him. I mean, he was one of the first companions. But he noticed okay. me, and we started talking, and he was really encouraging. Introduced me to Garris, and took me along on an expedition to the quarries and the mountains. Whatever flaws he may have, Byron cares about people. He changed my life. Yep. That's Byron in a nutshell. Okay. Yeah, Byron's the guy we're trying to save. He got sucked up into the giant mega structure. Ooh, look at where we are now. Awesome. So, here it looks like there should be an anti-gravity elevator, but it's locked down. I'll need you to connect to the data stream again. No worries. I'm really sorry, Wonka. I know it's a big risk. No, nah, it's I fine. I wish this technology wasn't so bloody unstable. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. <sighs> okay, cool. Let's not go any further. This will be it for this video. Deep, deep, deep. Uh, main menu. Yep. This is fun. I'm enjoying this. Um, yep, that'll be it. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. I will see you in the next one.